and welcome back to the last and final week of Sweet on Sundays. We made it to the end. I have a special guest that I have asked to join me in this collaboration and she has so graciously accepted and her name is Edwina Life TV. I will have her channel linked down in my description box. So guys, go over to her channel, subscribe, give her some love because she is a beautiful YouTube creator. She's one of my dear friends outside of the tube and she does the most beautiful home decor styles you just got to go check her out she her house is so beautiful so thank you so much edwina i love you so much and let's get started so i'm going to make a red velvet cake and i'm going to have something else to go along with that but we're going to first start off with our cake mix that i have already in my bowl and then you got to have three eggs. I have my water, which is a cup of water. And when I finish with that, I will be putting a half a cup of oil. I also have my frosting and I'm using the cream cheese frosting. And then here is my pan to put the cake mix in. cake is done everybody so what I'm gonna do is go ahead and add this delicious frosting to it all the way around okay guys the second part of my sweet treat will be this nice holiday drink that I thought of uh, what we're gonna do I have a martini glass now this is not gonna be a martini but my wine glasses, I had spray painted those and I don't have any regular glass um, glasses, so I'm gonna use the martini. We'll just have to do what we can do to make it work. And then I've got a can of Canada Dry ginger ale and I'm not gonna use all of it. And then some cranberries. I'm gonna add a few of these in the martini glass. This is my special holiday cranberry drink. It's very, very simple. You might have had one of these before. And because I have nails, I don't wanna break my nails trying to open up a can. So that's a little tip for you ladies to use something to lift that up. And then all you do is just pour some of this into your glass like that. Ooh, doesn't that look festive and cute? Now, if you don't like Canada Dry, you can use any type of drink you like, but I have this on hand, so this is what I'm using. And voila, isn't this 
nice. This is so nice. It's going to taste so, so good. So this is my holiday drink that I wanted to share with you. Cheers. Okay, we have already sliced our delicious red velvet cake. Mmm, doesn't that look good? I love red velvet. Aaron loves red velvet. We all like red velvet in this house. I'm going to top this off with a nice scoop of ice cream. Or two. All right, everybody. Here is the final look. I've got my cake and a little bit of ice cream. Delicious, delicious, delicious. And my nice festive drink. And you know, I always give a little taste, you guys. So let me go ahead and sample it. Just a little taste because I haven't eaten dinner yet. So I'm just going to just cut off, spoon off a little corner here. Just a little, you know, taste it a little bit. Yum, yum, yum. Mmm. So, so good. Woo, this is delicious, guys. And this drink, let me taste this drink. Doesn't that look really pretty and very festive? I just like the way it turned out. Well, we've got a winner, everybody. This is very, very good. I sure hope you guys have enjoyed watching this video as well as the other weeks prior. A special thank you to my special guest for this collaboration, Edwina. Thank you so much, Edwina, for joining me and uh, being gracious to accept my invitation. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And a big big special thank you to Simone Creations by Simone. Thank you Simone for asking me to be a host with you with this collaboration This was so much fun sis. So thank you. Thank you so much Thank you to both special guests your special guests as well the rogers house i'm gonna thank you as well and thank you all for watching and if you are new here welcome i'm so glad to have you my name is liz you guys take care have a nice sweet on sunday's treat bye bye